Oh, break a one nine, break a one nine. This here's the gear jam and deer. Whitetail's got your front door. Come on. So I think that I think I remembered to say in my first video showing off Sasha, my truck, my big GMC, that I was gonna keep you all up to date on anything I did with her. So this video isn't big. It's not anything special. I didn't do anything fancy. All I did was I replaced the knock sensors. So my first video. It was a check engine light. You can see now it's not on and the engine the engine is running. No check engine light. So all it was, give me just a second. My toolbox is in front of the seat over here and the old sensors are under the seat. There we go. Where'd the other one go? All right, well, I have a knock sensor. This was the passenger side one. The driver's side one is uh, still under the seat somewhere. I don't know where it went. <laughs> but that's what they look like. And in case you're looking to replace these yourself, if you have one of these trucks or uh, um, an RV with this engine, That's what you're looking for. So you got one on each side of the engine. Ugh. Sitting under a running truck is interesting. You got one on each side of the engine. Um, I think only one of them on this truck was bad, but I don't remember which one it was, so I just went ahead and replaced both of them. And according to what I read online, they actually go out fairly easily. They're fairly easy to break. So, um, but I also read that a knock sensor being bad has the potential to put the engine in service mode, which would lower your fuel economy, as well as other things. So I'm kind of hoping that that was the case because my truck's fuel economy was awful. And I don't imagine this would fix it much, but if the engine was in service mode, I might get an extra MPG now, which would be good. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. I just wanted to make that quick update video because I said I'd keep you up to date with Sasha. So, no more check engine light. Yay! Um, so thank you for watching, first of all. And until the next one, keep the hammer down, drivers.